It's time for our daily devotion, daily daily of abiding in Jesus Christ. In the book of John chapter 15 verse 7. If ye abide in me, and my words abide in you, ye shall ask what ye will, and it shall be done unto you. A daily devotional ministry project of Christo Dojino Gaga from passages taken from the Holy Scriptures with quotations from the Spirit of Prophecy by Ellen G. White. Daily, daily, daily abiding in Jesus Christ. Romans 8 verse 1 and 28 Verse 1 There is therefore now no condemnation to them which are in Christ Jesus, who walk not after the flesh, but after the Spirit. Verse 28 And we know that all things work together for good to them that love God, to them who are the called according to his purpose. Quotations from the Spirit of Prophecy While the Christian's life will be characterized by humility, it should not be marked with sadness and self-depreciation. It is the privilege of everyone so to live that God will approve and bless him. It is not the will of our Heavenly Father that we should be ever under condemnation and darkness. We may go to Jesus and be cleansed and stand before the law without shame and remorse. Great Controversy, page 477. Study the history of Joseph and of Daniel. The Lord did not prevent the plottings of men who sought to do them harm, but he caused all these devices to work for good to his servants who amidst trial and conflict preserved their faith and loyalty. By Ellen G. White, Ministry of Healing, page 487. Our prayer for you today. Dear God, our Father in Heaven, Today, we approach you with utmost awe and reverence because you are our Creator and most lovingly because you are our Father. We thank you for your ultimate love demonstrated by sending your begotten Son Jesus Christ to our sinful earth and to give us freedom from condemnation. Help us to walk in the Spirit. Thank you for answering our prayer because we ask in the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. Amen.